Hey guys, thank you for watching. Wait till you see this. <laughs> if you haven't seen this already, man, wait till you see this. If you think for one minute that NASA has told you the truth ever in the history of their history, wait till you see this. This is supposedly the Curiosity. You know that little carrito, that little car on Mars? <laughs> <laughs> Not on Mars. I think it's a little bit closer. Watch this. One day a year. So I keep digging a little bit deeper. And I finally get underneath this cloud cover here. And a few images pop up. And I say, oh, images, what are they? Well, this is what you got. Which I'm sure that looks familiar to you, right? Looks just like the pictures they give us of Mars. So I'm just kind of creeping around here and definitely noticing the same kind of undulation changes and same kind of rock, same kind of dirt. Only thing that's missing is that nice little red tint that they pay somebody $150,000 a year to put on there. And then I see these little things there. So oh, well, it's not Mars because they've got some weird little tires and little ATVs over there. But I was just kind of looking around, see what we could find. Another one of those ATVs, some antennas set up. But those mountains, those rocks, definitely exactly like we see on Mars. So I said, hmm, I wonder what they're doing out here. What is all this equipment for? I'm sure it can't be NASA, right? Um, who's Orange hum Hummer is this? Okay, that looks like a NASA symbol. Well, let's dig a little further because I can't really see anything on here other than it certainly looks like a NASA symbol. And I can't read that. Tried. Cameras set up. Tents. ATVs. Food. They've been there a while. It's not a one-day trip. Got their antennas set up. Out in the middle of nowhere in Greenland. Another ATV. A leveling. A leveler equipment. So, that was all that picture had. Let's see what this one's got. So, this one here said... Roving the Arctic. So what is that? Doesn't make any sense. We'll pop in here. See if we can find anything. Again, same kind of mountains. That looks like the same kind of water I've seen before that I thought was water on Mars. Who knows? Zoom in. What's that? Oh, nothing. Just looked like it was funny. So I'll keep kind of going through here and see if it... What the... <gasps> uh... Yeah, so, um, I think I found out where Mars is, guys. It's just uh, about a thousand miles north of me. Not quite the distance that NASA says, but I can't find anybody who's in charge of this. They must be hiding behind these rocks. Oh, no, there they are out in front of everybody, just standing there. Lovely. Clown number one, clown number two, and clown number three. These fools. All right, let's check out some of these other pictures. I saw another one over here. This one says Drill Hill. All right. Let's go in here. Totally looks like the Mars terrain to me. Just need the red filter. Let's see. Can we find anything? I just see the mountains. Do you see the stack rocks? There's the road like we saw on last Monday. I bet you these guys are just scamming us. Mm, nothing this whole way. Definitely looks like Mars terrain, though. All right, let's head back this way. Yeah, if you go look at Mars pictures, go to GigaPan or any site that has... You can even go to NASA.gov and look at all their Mars frauds. Check out those images. They're identical to these. Yeah, this is very empty here. Oh, there's one of those ATVs. Alright, now we're on something. Oh, I got another truck. Oh yeah, it says NASA. What's that say? Mars Project? Cheap, lying, no good, rotten, four fleshing, low life, snake licking, dirt eating, inbred, overstuffed, ignorant, blood... Sucking, dog-kissing, brainless, dickless, hopeless, heartless, fat-ass, bug-eyed, 
stiff-legged, spotty-lipped, worm-headed sack of monkey shit. Oh, thanks, Chevy. Couldn't have said it better myself. So that's what they're doing, huh? Got these scientists, I guess, up there driving ATVs, stealing everybody's money, sending pictures back from the car-sized rover. Oh, boy. Car-sized. This thing's just driving around taking pictures. Unbelievable. Actually, if you ask me, it's quite believable. But what do you think? Are they sending scientists up on ATVs to practice on the rover in a remote island in Greenland? Uh, I doubt that. Highly. But I did see something cool on the site. You could send Curiosity a postcard. So I was like, sweet. Sweet. 